once out of nature I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past or passing or to come. Hey, V. Happy to see me? Not exactly. Blacked out, then woke up here. I miss anything? Shame you couldn't watch. It was my magnum opus. You loved it. Mean yours and Rogue's, don't you? Rogue's dead. I'm sorry. Afraid things are pretty fucked for me too. Alt's hitting me with Soul Killer. My nerves are in shreds. Alt? Gonna show yourself? Say hi, maybe? I'm an engram now. A construct. Fuck. Yeah, well, welcome to the club. Hey Alt, you here? Told me she's finishing the check some, then she'll copy me back over into my flesh. Soul killer, we can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia, or data streams, certain sensations, inputs can be blocked, blah blah blah, yada yada. Alt make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture? Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say she'd destroy Mikoshi, just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards, only suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now. No. What the? Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. For fuck's sake, Alt. You had one job and you fucked it up? I could not know the situation before conducting a thorough and precise diagnosis. You promised this poor little shit a new life! And you lied! You fucking lied! Johnny, shut it for two seconds, will you? Gotta think. Gonna be alright, V. Think I said, something. give me one fucking minute. Oh, come on. There's got to be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. Hang on. You're telling your ex to kick me out of my own body? The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Alt, give us a... What the hell for? 
So you can trick me into a green? Giving you a free pass, even though you can already do what you want with my body? You're my friend, V. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. Seeing as how I'm doomed to die. We stick to the plan I gave you. I leave. You stay. Keys to my body are yours. No. It's gonna be me. You lying sack of shit. So what do I do, Walt? Simply cross the bridge. You will become a part of me, as V's body and former life are restored. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, easy. Ain't too big a dose of silver hand one. Just promise me one thing, asshole. You won't forget me. I can turn to face the sky. Today and today only, you might catch a glimpse of the Crystal Palace, that big-ass space station in which you mere mortals will never set foot. Now, they say the Crystal Palace has the most expensive casinos, the most beautiful women, and some damn breathtaking views, but that's what they say about Night City. Heaven on Earth, heaven in orbit. What's the difference to scop-eating dirt sniffers like us? One thing, though, better find yourselves a nice high hill to go palace gazing. Yep, sorry, you denizens of Night City's lower reaches. Life has screwed you over yet again. But for all you sitting in the gutter looking up at the smog, here's someone you ain't hurt in a while. Johnny Silverhand. What? Couldn't wait for me? I didn't want to wake you.
Fuck. Wanna do some Crystal Palace spotting? To hell with that palace. V... I... Is everything all right? You okay? No, I'm not okay. Nothing's okay. Fuck. Pan Am. I need air. I know one thing. This fucking city. I will not miss it. I really can't understand it. After all that happened in Makoshi, you feel no need to leave this shithole? Just... leave. Run and never look back. Run away with me. What would it change if I did leave with you? I only got a few months left anyway. It would be a few months among people you care about. People who care about you. Unless... Unless that's your point. You think the end could be easier? If you were alone? You know that's not true. I know this, V. Tomorrow I will be gone. We're breaking camp. We'll leave at dawn. I don't want to lose you, but I can't leave. I can't live or think any other way. Well, you know I always set my radio to Stanley. Will I hear about you? You can bet on it. Fuck. I so detest goodbyes. I had a saying in my clan. No goodbyes. Only roads that four can converge. Nomads say all sorts of shit. Speaking of which, you still owe me that story of that guy from Caucasus. One who rode in your trunk. I'll tell you. Someday. Somewhere. If our roads meet again. Till next time. I will remember V.
Go on. They're waiting. Counting on you. Good morning, V. Where shall we zip off to today? The afterlife. Head over there. Absolutely. We'll be taking those special air corridors. Excited as I am. So we should make good time. Awesome. My, you look knackered. Hard night. Difficult few weeks. Golly, I'm sorry to hear that. Your incursion into Arasaka Tower has given you all. Respect. Unlimited resources. Now for physical ailments. If it helps, I can offer additional services and spa treatments and whatnot. That may be just the thing for your current condition. In fact, I've teamed up with Trauma Team to provide a medical care package. Limited time offer. Safe travels, I call it. You could try it now. What do you say? How's the sitch in the city? Arasaka's in a right pickle. An organizational shambles. Its share price has tanked. Public mistrust is at an all-time high. I could go on. Secure Your Soul was to be a mammoth success for Arasaka. It turned into a mammoth curse. They lost all resources related to the program. Mm hmm Promised the rich immortality. Sold them on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge. A bit for control. For power, I say. And the street? What's the street saying? Rumors abound, naturally. You're onto something huge with someone even huger backing you. Their resources yet more huge. Nothing much besides. Arasaka's a mess, trying to rein in the chaos. At any rate, you, the afterlife, you're safe. For some time, anyway. Prem. Just Prem. Box is ready and waiting. If you are looking for a taste of hey, v. get you something? My usual. Sure thing. People can tell something's up. Won't be able to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take offs today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no, just... In that case, you're gonna need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. Know what she said? Said it was about remembering. 
Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. Anyways, afterlife tradition. I'm gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking to. So, what did hit the spot about now? Mix me up a silver hand. Drink it to Johnny. I mean, I only know what people say about him, but Betty'd love what you're planning. Shit, you're here with a damn moon. I know. Good luck, V. Hey, boss. Waylon. Back and better than ever? Ready and waiting. You tell anyone here about that stunt you pulled at Arasaka Tower? What do you think? Claire must have heard it three times already. But what you plan to do today, V? I mean, respect. Nothing else will ever come close. Take good care of yourself. And good luck. Thanks. V. I've long awaited this moment to look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I'm moved. Happy not to disappoint. Sit, sit. Talk to me. Well, V. Rikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies. Influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the op. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Having second thoughts? Hope that doesn't mean you want to drop out. Drop out? At this stage? No. It would make no sense. I'd take a hit. Speaking of which... Nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. They'd be dead wrong. All of them. Self-confidence worthy of a legend. Or of someone risking it all. <laughs> but I sense you know what it's like to lose everything. To fight for one last breath. I see it in you. This time tomorrow, should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Right. In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. Yeah, tell me something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Okay. 
Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. What's up, kid? Been a while since you came to see old Vic. I'll bet your chums at the afterlife found you a new Major League Ripper, huh? Them swanky downtown fucker shooting chrome out his ass? Am I right? Well, I mean it, kid. Get all you can out of this life. You deserve it. More than anyone I know. But stop by sometime, okay? Next time you're in the neighborhood, Talk about old times, and I'll take a look at you. Make sure that the new Ripper of yours didn't screw anything up. See you around, V. the top of your game in all of Night City? <laughs> yeah, I left all that. I guess I'm just calling to say thanks for everything. Wasn't until I'd left everything behind that I realized how depressed I was for all that time. Take it from me, V. If you ever get the chance, just leave. Leave and don't look back. The weight it takes off your shoulders, I... I can't even describe it. All right, enough lecturing. Take it easy, man. Hey, V! How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's a sandstorm heading straight for us. So, yeah, you're missing out. No, oh, but seriously, we're, we're all getting by. Family never stops growing. Work's always piling up. 
Sometimes all I wish for is a good night's rest. But oh well. Can't have everything, right, B? You know what I mean. Let me know when you get bored of the city. I'll take you for a nice, long ride. All right, now. Take care, V. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Aldo Caldo. Remember that. Uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. So, funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fine. So, uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you can care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, well, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. This city needs more people like you. And I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab. And they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, well, when, when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, yeah, and don't forget to delete this message. So I laid out a quick tarot. 
I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Babe, the world's gonna hear about you. Go and show Night City what you're made of.